back. I'm first alert meteorologist Jamie Ertle. When I checked the forecast coming in the current temperatures, I was surprised to see that we did have 60s out there, upper 60s in fact, but we are talking about a first alert weekend because of potentially dangerously cold wind chills. Now you see 20s, but you may feel like teens and I'm talking lower teens on Sunday, maybe even some single digits. So this is an effect for all weekend. Remember those four P's and if you can, Check on your peeps as well, your people. Take a look at this from our Plant Riverside District Sky Cam. A beautiful, bright green, evergreen ship coming into port. Current temperatures out there, like I said, 60s. But with the wind, and we don't really calculate wind chills when we're in the 60s, it is brisk out there. We have fallen to 52 Swainsboro, 56 in Statesboro, 57 in Vidalia. And as colder air rushes in, we'll continue to fall as we head through the next 12 hours. So if you're planning on going out this evening, notice that we drop from 59 at, six, at 5 o'clock to 46 at 8. And that's when those wind chills will start feeling a little bit colder than the actual air temperature out there and a hard freeze prolonged period of freezing and sub freezing temperatures. Fair and fair, a first alert live radar on a slow sweep. Some of you might had some sprinkles this morning. Those are moving well off the coast and south and Florida cold front moving off the coast and Arctic air, a polar cold high pressure coming in hot. Take a look at the wind streams here. We are looking at our current winds in the teens, upper teams, even some 20s across the coast. Empire and low country and current wind gusts 25 in the borough 32 at the airport 31 on the south side and even near 40 in Beaufort waking up on our Saturday 25 Estill Hampton 27 Glenville 27 Jessup 28 Savannah freezing for the islands and what will it feel like with the winds still in play on almost 10 degree difference so it feels like the teens Statesboro Sylvania Estill Glenville south of the Altamaha low 20s Savannah to the coast as we head into our Saturday that is that is a little uh, disappointing that we don't see temperatures into the upper 40s just about mid 40s for the highs and it'll start to fall once we hit the late afternoon again even plunging colder into our Sunday so forecast high Saturday 46 Alma Baxley Jessup 43 the high in Statesboro that's near our average low this time of year 47 Savannah Rinkin, 43 Ridgeland, 44 Hilton Head, 47 in Beaufort. Here are Sunday potential wind chills forecasting 19 in Statesboro and Claxton, 22 Savannah may feel like 11 in Savannah, may feel like 10 in the borough and Claxton. And like I've said all week, I would not be surprised if one or two cities hit the single digit feels like temperature. So Sunday overall feeling the most cold that we've had this season. And so that's when a lot of you will be going out to church or brunch, so please be careful. 27 Monday, it's going to be feeling like the teens west of I-95, so that's why it's still a first alert. Then we warm up rapidly and a little bit of an unsettled weather pattern, trying to time out some of this rain, AM rain, PM rain, some peaks of sunshine, but just notice that the temperatures climb to the mid-70s by mid-work week.